my marina boom boom it's recording everything looks cool why ask why why marina hey this is a beautiful 1440 frontier staby craft these are awesome boats me personally i wouldn't suggest it but me personally i'd take this across the ocean even on a rough day they're unsinkable self bailing nice boat there's your bladders for cell baiting i leave them up like that actually if you want to drain it when you run and let them down it's just this little clip right here got one plug down there there's your big tank pump right there you got 11 by 12 pitch prop here it's a 50 horse inline four cylinder salt water protected got zinc on every cylinder zinc on the block zinc right there and zinc everywhere it's got stainless prop shaft prime shaft Ooh, it's so sexy. Got some marks on the motor. Better mark that down. My little list. But that's okay. Oil drain here. Then you got your trim here. Boom, boom. You got your stops there. So how you work those is you trim that baby up. You drop these things down. You go until they just drop and just barely touch it until they hit. So just make sure you go like this. And then I let it down a little bit before I put it in the water. You got little swim steps right there. Oh, you got a grab handle here. This is a 2021. Two, one. Uh, anyway, two coats of clear, two primer. Oh, got a little scuff over there too. Uh, anyway, back to the, oh, this orange. It's so sexy. Ooh, you gotta love it. Can, can I touch you? Oop, that, that's sexist, I think, or something. Anyway, uh, very stable they're chambered boats unsinkable very stable you can stand on the gunnel you put water in it the sucker's going to be level it's the safest boat you can you forget the drain plug what the heck you got uh, gear about the oil hub ground good white bag yes yeah, five lug about 45 pounds of air in the tire leaf springs carlisle tires or st 17580 r13s and on this boat right here uh you have 30 horse Oh, you know something. This must be uh oh. I'm a little confused, but you know, hey, when AI. I? But uh, I'll get back to you on that. 50 horse is plenty of power on here. And it's got a 20 inch transom. You got the external beam is like 67 inches. You got a 16 degrees dead rise. And it's got a portable tank on this one too. Uh, right here we're using our shop tank uh, you can get these i think you might have to go to the 15 to get the internal it's an option but six gallons will run this thing forever uh you got a mat that they made back here there's a battery switch you got your battery you got your 6y8 gauge here if you turn the key on you got so the fuel ain't gonna read here fuel management won't read here either because you need your sensors unless they hooked it up to the motor itself and this has got the VTS in it, and so so got your tag right here with your hours. Then you got your oil, water, batteries, and hours here. And like I say, I'm gonna check this. Sometimes it read because it went through the harness. And you got cable steer, 703 control box, stainless steel pole holders, cup holders. And this kind of makes it cool here too. That you can sit on that all the way around there. You got a grab handle. This is gonna get a bow mount too. It hasn't got here yet. Everything you know, COVID stuff. And then your battery would go right there. And if you want to hook up a battery charger, there you go. All that will work. You got your cooler seat right up here, fillet table over there. Uh, like a neat little boat. Look at all the chain. You got chambers in here. Then you got this preplex hole. That the more flex you got where they're bent like that, the stronger this boat is. And then you got up under here, you got this with the Gala G3 tubing, which it cuts back with a reverse. What that does is when it comes down, there's air that gets up underneath here and it slows the boat down so it doesn't hit as hard and you got an easy loader double dip galvanized trailer you got load guides swing tongue and crank it until it sits flat right there and then you could actually when you have this over here take another strap basically from here and just go down to here and then just tight to keep the front down when you're bouncing around going down the highway uh, swing tongue uh, when you fold that out you fold it back in again make sure you tuck the trailer wires they got them in looming now but you tuck it inside so it doesn't pinch it when you lock it it's a two inch ball you got your uh, standard flip flat four on the trailer wires 
this thing is only like 960 pounds i think total if i remember right i'm gonna have to look this up because i can't remember the total dry weight total tow weight 860 pound boat motor trailer and gasoline i mean unbelievable anyway happy halloween to you oh i'm just saying it ain't halloween <laughs> it's orange beaver orange you gotta love it there's your bait tank oh brown good white bad oh she's so hot hey i can't say that i'm that's not woken up the it, it is it's oh well it doesn't matter side console uh you wait now i'm gonna do on water but what a neat little boat i'm telling you for bay like where i'm going to be running or rivers lakes jetties you, you can feel completely safe it's a 2021 1450 stabby craft it sold us going to the boat show portland boat show by golly finally i think that's next weekend if i'm not mistaken this is the boat doctor tata or tati or oops there it goes i'm out of here boat doctor out